What's up guys? Welcome to another episode of TC Fishing. I'm Ben. We're out here on a small stock brook trout lake. Looking to catch a bunch of brookies today. I already got one. Missed one. So, so far it's been a good morning. Hopefully we can get a bunch more on film for you guys. Um, out here with Mitch Platt. Welcome to my humble abode. That thing's been, uh, well they're slow right now, but they started off hot. As Ben said, got a fish on the ice, and uh, yeah, good times. We had a random dog out here chase us out, and uh, that was interesting. So now we're gonna heat things up in the hut. Hopefully get some underwater footage for you, and uh, hopefully things turn out here. You got him? Just set up. We got a random oh, dog man, near us. We got a random get dog. Get the dog out of there, Mitch. Come here, come here, puppy. That's a nice one. <laughs> Maple! <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I got her. Yeah. That's a nice brookie. This is going to be terrible quality. Sorry, we rushed to get this. I rushed to get the camera. We just set up. Things are hectic. Dude, I perfectly pinned it in the mouth. Right. The fish trap works wonder. Ben already missed a fish because he wasn't using the fish trap. No, no, you can't have it. <laughs> Hopefully Maple's owners comes and get her. They live right there. Probably shouldn't be showing that. Show the camera, the beautiful fish. So I can, <laughs> so I can tend. <laughs> yeah, I can't hold on to her. We gotta get rid of this dog. It's a nice one, one and a half pounder. Nice. Yeah, if you guys want to see a video of uh, how to make your own automatic type fish type fisherman trap, um, we'll make one comment, soon. And we'll make a vid. That's what they look like. They're a lot cheaper than an actual automatic fisherman, I can tell you. That. And they are legal, so. And they work. Cool. Okay, we're gonna set back up and. I'm gonna bury it so you can't find it. Frame of it. Yeah, I think he's got it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's got it. <laughs> Jeez, he was playing with it for a while. Yeah. You want to pull my transducer? And butt the ice. Oh, he's not happy. Jeez, he's taken. Does it feel like a good one, like your other one? Yeah, it feels about the same as the other one. Oh, it's nice. It's nice. Right. Oh, but I'm I'm a little pumped up right now. <laughs> this guy came in slowly and he didn't take it right away. But watching our other tip ups, tell me when you're gonna get him at the hole here. I'm gonna try it real soon. Oh, his head won't come in the hole. Oh boy, man, that's a nice one. Oh man, I don't want to lose him. Oh my, oh my gosh, that's a nice oh, freaking oh, oh brookie, dude. Goodness, dude. Oh. Oh, he ate the spoon, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> he ate the spoon. Okay, so, you. let me see your rig and stuff after. Dude, this is a three-way rig. Dang, that's a nice brookie. Oh my goodness, this is definitely my PB brookie, largest brookie. Man, that's a sick stock like brookie. He ate the EGB. You can see it poking out right there. Swiss, Swiss. This is the rig. Swiss EGB. I don't know what size it is. We should get this footage on phone instead. So let's yeah. talk. Well, about we'll the do fish. both. We'll do both. Man, that's I got a little fly on there as well. Let's we'll talk more about that later. Let's show that. There. Are you gonna keep it or? Yeah, let me wash it off. Get all this. Oh, I'm keeping this fish 110. percent We gotta get. Can you get pictures too? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Well, it's fresh and I'm stuff. dumping this on. <laughs> Doesn't even care. Man, that's so nice. I might have my scale. Yeah, we should weigh it. My hands are so freaking cold right now. Doesn't even matter. <laughs> well, let me just... <laughs> Camera's still on. Let me get me. Let me get a pan. That is definitely my PB brookie right there. Big brookie through the ice. That is a nice fish.
Oh my Mitch is gosh. hooked up. That was sick. We got all that underwater footage right there. We just got this on video. Just stop. It's just a little guy, but damn. I didn't get that all on video, actually. He came and looked at my underwater camera here. He looked and, right uh, at the like camera. Really right at it. I wish I was recording. It was hilarious. Like he actually came up like this. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, his whole face filled the I camera. I started rigging. I started jigging that super hard, and he just choked that goby bug. Well, actually, he didn't. He swiped it. But yeah, he swiped it. He ate it nonetheless. He got that hook. Here we go. Beautiful. Oh wow! Look at those colors. That's nice. Tilt it's gonna it flop in. any in. second here. And... Tilt it in. Tilt it. Tilt it. Nice. Greens Beautiful. and purples. And blues. Meet me at the front door. Meet me at the front door. Come on inside, folks. <laughs> now Ben's got four already. I only have two. Nice one. Well, you came close to hooking that one, right? Tell them about the viewers how, will have already seen Tell them that. about how they're fanning already and stuff. Like, check out these tails. These are stock brookies. They cannot spawn. And well, they, they try. Yeah, last fall before before freeze up, probably in late September, early October, they were trying to spawn. And, uh, yeah, you can see evidence of that in the rounding of the tail. Hi, Mr. Cole. Hutt, man. <laughs> Show you what I'm using today. Uh, this is my perch bait, and I decided to give it a try. That's a Gamma Gatsy 211 round hook, 1 16th. And we got a 1.5 inch uh, Gobi Bug, which they've discontinued. This is a Houdini color. Uh, I really wish they still made them, but at least I stocked up before they got rid of them. And uh, yeah, three pound line. Nice. Bye. I was catching them on four, so you don't need three. Four is good. Six is too much, though. 110, too much. Check my tippy. She's down. She's down. Oh, fish. He, he chased me. Are you recording? Look how far he chased me up. Oh, he just nailed it! He just nailed it! Oh my gosh. He's around my lure right now. I just seen him flash. Oh, I see him. He's coming back down. Is he? Yeah, he's oh. right near yours. He just took a swipe at it. I'm getting this all on camera. Oh, come on, come back. Chase it. He's chasing yours. Oh, he missed it? Yeah. We're getting this all on footage, eh? Bang bottom, bang bottom. Yours makes more... I'm in between rocks. Is he bored? Is he gone? Is he coming back? Come back. Dang it. Ah, <laughs> oh, that was so close. Wasn't very big though, was he? He's a nice one. Probably bigger than all my fish that I've got. That's a good sign though. Check my tippy. Could have very well gone over there. Hopefully he did go over there. It's not off yet, but it might go off. He did go that way. Well, he sort of went behind the camera. Oh man, that was so close. He was going to eat this thing too, right? He, he swiped at it twice. Yeah, I can't believe I missed him. And he hit mine. Like... Almost under the ice. He was aggressive. He hit mine. Man. I can't believe we didn't hook that fish. He hit mine. Holy frig. We're on fire here, boys. This is 
just a wild day on the ice. This guy is about the same size as that. This guy is feisty. Same size as what? Same size as my first one. Okay, that's good. Damn. <laughs> that was a weasel. Good tip. Trout are feisty. Put your put your feet over the hole so they yeah. don't go back in. You don't actually lose your prize. <laughs> well, zoom in on this fish. Look, he has like three halos. That's it. Wow. That Let's is see. weird. One, two, three. We just learned how to count. <laughs> Mission time. Teach something. your kids how to count with brook trout halos. Oh, Here man, he, on Team Colfer. He pinned that. The fish trap just, I can't even get this out. The fish trap just annihilates. Yep, homemade. We literally, Ben just got his PB and then his tip up went off. <laughs> and he smoked this, so. Woo! Good thing we didn't Looks go like to Simcoe. Looks like we're going to limit out today, fellas. Good thing we didn't go to Simcoe. <laughs> well, I ain't walking in the snow <laughs> on Simcoe. Look so. at these colors, though. I don't know if you can even see this. You can tell camera. we're gassed. We're like totally breathing heavy. I just drilled a hole, running <laughs> back and forth. Okay, we'll be back. I wonder if you can see this color so variation. Cool. This hole is so hot, I can't even keep my lure down it. Just hooked up with this really colorful male. You can see his spawning colors are just starting to leave. He would have spawned in, he would have tried to spawn in the fall, but... Mitch is hooked up. Does it feel good? No. <laughs> Classic. What did you just minnow. Minnow. <laughs> I, I hooked him in the back, buddy. Cranked him. At this point... Now I need, need a, a bigger big, fish. I need a big one. <laughs> Tired of these little dudes, but they're fun. Yeah. They still put a good bend in the rod. Well, last half of the day was pretty slow. It was just a classic brookie day, the last half. Yeah, we marked some fish, but couldn't get any, anything to go. Now we got a long trek back. And a foot or more of snow. For the more. What's up, guys? TC fishing. Yeah, we're pumped. You know why? Because we had a good day. Had and a great probably day. Probably the best brook trout day of our life. Well, we could probably duplicate it sometime, but I don't Hopefully. know when. Hopefully, <laughs> again. Uh. Yeah, we're gonna go celebrate with um, a couple lattes <laughs> and donuts. <laughs> Only reason I would never really order a latte, to tell you the truth. Okay. But roll the rims back in. Yeah. Oh yeah. Now listen here, folks. Latte. As we get up this hill. If we get up. For this all hill. the noobs. Okay, we're gonna need four wheel drive. We're gonna need four wheel drive. This but for all the noobs that don't know how to roll up the rim. See, that's where it is. Let's let's pretend I didn't roll up the rim. You're gonna fold it like this, and you're gonna roll up your thumb. Let me show you the other side. Fold and roll. See how easy that was? Don't be gnawing on it like a beaver. Okay, you can if you want, but I mean, if you want an easier way, this is how you do it. And that's your coffee tip. And I'm not sponsored by Timmy's. Bob Zumi is. But Bob call, Zumi, you but Timmy's, call me. Yeah, Timmy's, give me a call. Call me up. And uh, let's let's do this uh, four wheel drive thing. Four high. Hoping my wheels are straight. Suzuki, bro. Suzuki. It's actually a Nissan. <laughs> Nissan motor. Suzuki body. I don't know about that even. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure it's just as the badges. Suzuki badges. <laughs> yeah. That's Nissan it. everything. Else. <laughs> sick. Equator. Still sick Suzuki whip. Suzuki Equator. Now you just gotta get a Suzuki outboard. We saw ladies on the lake and they just parked on the road and walked down somebody's cottage road. They asked me if I had any luck. I lied to them. Bad boy. I told them that we only got two little fish. Which isn't true. So anyways, what did we get? Eight fish and lost one? Eight brookies. Seven, I think. 
pretty good day. Seven lost one, so a total of eight hooked. Almost limited out, which is insane. I've never accomplished something like that before. Is this an intro or an outro? This is an outro. So you guys already know we got eight fish. Actually, no, we don't have footage for everything, I guess. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Uh, comment, subscribe, tell your friends to subscribe. We'll, uh, tell your parents to subscribe. <laughs> and yeah, if you want to see a quick, uh, awesome perch video, yeah, go watch that one if you haven't already. Or don't. Or don't. Brookies are better. Brookies, yeah. Actually, I can't say that. I like them. Well, <laughs> yeah. Brookies fight harder, that's for sure. <laughs> Alright, peace. Have a good one.